how's it going people my name is shadow and we are here again in starfield in the last episode we ended up finishing up the quest i actually forgot what it was called in the footsteps where we had to obviously first go to uh luna our moon to go to the nova galactic research thing that was there or nasa's research thing whichever one um and find some information about what was happening like towards earth and everything and then we ended up getting sent down to nasa's uh headquarters where we ended up finding a another artifact and we ended up finding out the story on what actually happened to earth and it turns out that the artifact is the reason why there is no longer a earth but what we are doing today is we are going to be finishing off the uh hopefully finished unearthed which obviously all we've got to do first is finish final glimpses so we have to go talk to vladimir uh i'm thinking he is in the lodge so we'll go talk to vladimir and I'm, if i remember rightly he needs to he go off and get another two maybe three artifacts i think and then obviously we end up finishing unearthed so let's get on with it shall we I wonder what has happened while we have been away. Ah, uh, probably not a lot, Andresia. Right, let's go and speak to Vladimir. I'm hoping you two don't turn around and say, I need to talk to you. These last glimpses from the eye are from the farthest fringes of known space. Could be the only remaining pieces outside the hands of the star god. I haven't needed to go up there in a bit. Why? Thanks, Vladimir. I'll follow up on oh, these. I just... Catch a smile out there. Doesn't. They're all alone for so long. Ah, two. Some so we've got two artifacts to go and claim. I'm hoping that these are going to be something decent. But considering how far out we probably have to travel, I really doubt it. I don't know, we may get a uh Well Freya, we're not gonna be able to now, I think that one's going to be a cave. Whereas this one down here may end up being a spacer or ecliptic camp. But well, let's go find out, shall we? Anything interesting here? Hey, stop. No, I am not talking to you. Stroud Eklin ships may be good, but so what? A ridiculous amount of credits was dumped into them. All oh, right, is that conversation again? Tech, okay. That's all. Let us just ignore that. And it's a occupied cave. Why is it always a cave? Right, and here we are. We have to... What the hell are these things? You know what? I might as well for the XP. Wow, he is tanky. Um, Give me... No, that. Uh, thanks for the help, Andresia. Just standing there. Eh, uh, there's nothing of interest. Alright, how far have we got to go? Uh, 300 metres, that's not too bad. Ooh, look. Palladium. In the ground, that's nice to see. Water, other, th other stuff. But, let's head on over and see... What kind of occupied cave it is. I don't know if it's going to be aliens or if it's going to be uh, spaces or ecliptic. I'm hoping for spaces or ecliptic. I want to get into a firefight instead of having to just kill aliens all the time. Oh, it looks like a little camp outside the cave. Do we have anyone? We have dead people. What do we have? We have dead miners. Of course we do. Let's take all of that. Right, let's go see what we got. Hello, anyone home? Oh, it's just going to be an empty cave. Well, that's no fun. Let the emergency kit. Nothing of interest. Oh, what is that? An animated 
an elemented an elemental calibrated razorback which is all oh, right the revolver furious poison and that's actually not too bad i'll take all of that well there's a bit more in and nova lie uh take the um open the gun take the credits is there seriously no one in here? Just a load of resources and other things. Ooh, another tranqui tranquility. Lovely. Dominate the Baron. Yeah, yeah, take it. Take all of it. Why not? Always worth checking. Never know what you might find in their pockets. Yeah, I want to know what killed them. I mean, I know the only fight that we're probably going to end up having is the starborn as we get closer to the artifact. Wait, have I... I'm following the wrong bloody uh, marker, aren't I? Yeah. Right, there we go. Right. Is the starborn coming out? Coming out to play. Yeah? No? Really? There we go. Oh, I love the parallel self. The power. And Andresia has just disappeared. What is happening with the companion? Right, uh, there it is. <laughs> right, what the, what? Oh, that was the, uh, duplicate dying. Right then, next stop, Freya. Oh, hello, what we got here? Hey, Mayday! This is easy to... Explosion, high-energy research lab. Massive damage, overrun, requesting emergency evac, please. Ah. Uh... I remember this mission. Yeah, we actually got something interesting to do. Sweet. Right, let us get down to the research station, shall we? Right then, here we are at the uh, research station lab thing. This is going to be interesting. With this mission, there are two ways. Actually, technically, no, there are three ways you can complete this mission. Two of the ways are literally handed straight to you. To be like, you can either do it this way or do it that way. And the other way is a hidden way. We are going to try to attempt to do that hidden way. I have never done it, so this is going to be interesting. You should have research station. You speaking. What is your business here? Uh, I'm responding to your distress signal. What? We haven't sent a distress signal? Nothing on the comms. No other ships in the system since our last supply drop. Look, what are you trying to pull here? It said there was an explosion in your high energy research lab. Really? The high energy research lab? Hmm. Alright. I don't know what's going on here. But you should talk with the director. For security, I'm going to have to ask your friend to wait out there. What's inside? Stay with me and don't make any sudden moves. I'll get the door. Welcome to Nishina. It seems a strict policy, but in a way that is reassuring. Suggest they know what they are doing. Do not worry about me. Go ahead and go. Okay, Andreja. Stay safe. Step 
scan is clear. One moment. Well, I should hope so. Attention all. I am declaring a code yellow. All sections are now on lockdown. Senior staff, protocol Delta. Use out. There. Be right with you. Yeah, hurry up about it. Come on, you're bloody trapped on something. Thank you. Ethan Hughes, Chief of Security. If you'll follow me, I'll show you to the director. All right, let's go. We'll take the back way up. Here, you can see our lovely storage area. Don't touch anything. Lovely, mate. So, Lovely. Uh, Nishina was built to bore. Yep. What the? Easy, easy! What the hell was that? You told me. One minute, you're following me, and then you're just gone. Minute later, you pop in out of nowhere, looking like you were in the middle of a fight. Uh, because I was. But there's nothing here. I should have never let you inside. What is this? Some kind of stealth tick. Who are you working for? Dude, I don't know any more than you do. <sighs> Look, I don't know what's going on. Let's get you to the director. Maybe she can figure this out. Yeah, probably. Come on, this way. Honestly, this quest was really well done for how it happens and all goes around. Right, explore Azir Ruins. Who's there? Hello. Oh, oh, thank God. Finally, someone came. The distress signal. You picked up the distress signal, right? Ah, uh, starvation, dehydration. You're in bad shape. Yeah, yeah, I know. I wouldn't have made it much longer. It's been so long. I'm out of food, out of water, but I made it. I, wait, how did you get in here? Hughes was taking me to see the director, and then I was just here. Hughes? Ethan Hughes? But he's dead. No. No, no, no. This doesn't make any sense. Unless... The accident. Maybe... Maybe this is a side effect of the accident. If the probe is still feeding power to the distortion, then... Probe, distortion, right. Right. We were studying a gravitational distortion. Three months ago, I was calibrating an experiment in our high energy research lab. There was an accident, an explosion. It caused a gas leak, sparked a fire. I was trapped in the control room. There was nothing I could do. They're, they're all dead. Uh, you're experimenting on an artifact. An artifact? You mean the metallic god? Fuck sake. We should. Wait, he's back. Of course, I'm right. back. We're on our way up. Hughes out. Right in the middle of a conversation. In the director. Let's keep moving. Yeah, that that's because. If anything happens, the director's office is on the second floor, end of the hall. You can't miss it. Uh, sure. Second floor, end of the hole. Uh, give me the shot. Why does the thing need reloading? Okay. 
Okay then. Uh. Yep. I I am not reading that. You can though. Just pause the video. Right. Um. Take the credits. And obviously now is not probably the best time to be searching around for everything, but... See, that, that, that gets me. How did I get poisoned and nothing even hit? Where's the camera? Yeah, 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 yeah. We'll sort out the poison in a minute. Yeah, yes, here I am. Uh, yeah, give me a second. I got poisoning to deal with. Uh, oh, please tell me I've got some. Po there we go, snake oil. Lovely. I really can't wait until they decide to give um, a survival mode Thank into you. this. That'd be interesting. Come in. Kaya Patel, research director. And this is our chief scientist, Maria Hughes. Ethan said you disappeared right in front of him. Twice now? Three times? Director, you can't be taking this seriously. Look, I don't know who you are or what you're doing here, but there has to be a rational explanation for all of this. Yeah, I'm shifting to an alternate universe or something. Excuse me? You're excused? That is quite a claim. What makes you think that? Tell us about this other universe. Uh, it's burned out. And Raphael. Raphael? Raphael? No, Raphael. Yeah, Raphael. Raphael was the only survivor. Raphael? Raphael died in the accident. He... Wait. Burned out? The leak. Director, there was a hydrogen leak right after the accident. It was contained in a minute or two. But if it hadn't been, it could well have caused an explosion. Another universe, though. That's a lot to swallow. He also said you found an artifact. An artifact? You mean the source of the distortion? You know something about it? I've seen what they can do. It's why I'm here. Really? That's all you're gonna say? Yep. No, no. Fair enough. You have a prior connection with them, then. Maybe that's why this is only affecting you. Well, uh, I need to know what you were doing here. Not doing to it. <sighs> This facility and the research level two kilometers beneath us were built to study a gravitational distortion. This artifact and the field it creates. Three months ago, our chief engineer, Raphael, was calibrating an experimental probe when something went wrong. We still don't know what happened. There was a series of explosions and somehow it's still running. Then shut the damn thing off. What do you think? We haven't tried? The kill switch on the control unit isn't responding. The explosion must have damaged the failsafe. We could shut it off manually, but the entire research level is locked down. We can't even get down there. Uh, well, we have to find a way to stop this. How? I told you the research level's locked down. We can't even use the damn elevator. Maybe I could, in the other universe. What? Clever. In this other universe, Raphael survived. He made it back from the lab, so clearly his elevator works. Take it, and you might be able to shut down the experiment. This is crazy. You're telling me. But first, we have to do something about your shifting. Maria, you mentioned a control unit earlier. We can't shut down the probe, but we might be able to adjust some of the other parameters. It's risky. We don't know what we're dealing with, but 
<sighs> All right. It's worth a try. Then it sounds like we have a plan. Lovely. Come with me. The control unit is in the fabrication lab next door. It's what good to know. ourselves into? I don't know, love. Yay! Uh, right. Hi. Reload. Alright, let me have a look around before I go off and speak to uh, Raphael. Also deal with one of these creatures. Where are they? There they are. I don't even know why I'm going to try and search them. They've got nothing interesting on them. I'll take the credits. Take the ammo. Now, I think I know where I've got to go to... Oh. Oh. Do the thing it's I was you. on about. Hi. What happened? You disappeared, and the ceiling caved in, and... and... <sighs> I thought I'd finally lost it. I'm a figment of your imagination. No, uh, I met with the director. We have to shut down the probe. What? How? Look, if you think things are bad up here, the research level is even worse. I barely made it out, and that was months ago. I don't understand any of this. If I hadn't seen you disappear with my own eyes, I wouldn't have believed it. I... <sighs> okay, okay. You're my ticket out of here. We'll do this your way. We can get out through the pantry. Here's the key. I'll back you up, I guess. E yeah. I'll take the I guess as a... You'll do whatever you can. Hopefully you'll be better than my brick wall who loves to talk, who isn't with me. So, ah. Losing my own train of thought here. Hello, stop picking shit up, for fuck's sake. Uh, just open the door. Oh, what the? How did you... Security breach! Everybody go, out! Go. Run for it! Out of my way! Ah. Oh, right, yeah, the whole place is on lockdown, hey. isn't it? Um. Yeah. Uh, can you move? I want to see if there's anything else around her. Nope. Oh, okay. Wasn't even worth coming back. Can we not even get these doors open? No. Of course we can't. Hi. Yeah, I've, uh, I've been poisoned again for no bloody. Reason. All right, Raphael. Look at this. It's going to take hours to clear this out. Assuming the rest of the building doesn't come down on top of us. What will happen when I shut down the probe? I'm not sure. It might stop whatever's happening to you. It's a reasonable theory, I guess. Alright, what now? Looks like we're at a dead end. How should I know? You're the one who keeps winking in and out of existence. I just want to get out of here. Go do whatever you're going to do. I'll see if I can clear a path to the door. I... Uh, yeah, sure. Alright, uh, nothing in here. Okay... Ah, hello, mate. What? I... Oh, it's you. You realize you just popped into my locked office. So much for security protocols. Yeah, it's not my fault. I'm trying to get to the fabrication lab. Uh, sure. 
Down the hall. Take the stairs next to the atrium. Yeah, let me get the doors for you. And done. Is there anything else you need? Uh No. I don't need anything else. Apart from I'm not even gonna bother opening that or unlocking that. No. Nope. No, no, no. Uh no, I prefer my shy. Oh, uh, don't bother with that for fuck's sake. Yeah, I prefer my shotty even though the damage on it is beginning to get a bit um on the low side, shall we say. But the explosive procs they do help. Ah! Right, let's go and get the bloody particle thing before I end up moving around and searching stuff. Because this does end up getting a bit annoying when you have no control over it. Let's take the emergency kit. Good, we're good. Right, Doctor. What did you get lost in the hallway? Yeah. Uh, all right. <laughs> this is the probe control unit. Most of these controls aren't responding. I'm going to very carefully adjust the settings I can. There's no way to tell what's about to happen. Pay attention and be ready for anything. I'll begin by adjusting the energy feed of the electron beam array. We're at 93 terabolts. Calibrating to 95, 97, 100. Ugh, nothing. Let's try the other way. 91, 89. Ooh, look! You made something okay, shiny. Okay. It looks safe to approach. I don't know, love. Let's go check it out. I even stand in it for you. Look. Whee! It's a micro distortion. Flux pattern matches the distortion in the lab. The setting is just exposing it somehow. Hmm. Step into the distortion, please. Uh, alright. Not like I haven't already done it. <sighs> I'm not even in it. Nothing. Hold on. There's a slight pattern change. Some kind of resonance. All right, stay there. Let me turn the feedback up for a moment. Calibrating to 90, 91. Jesus Christ, can I not have a drink of me coffee? Jesus. All right. Uh, yeah, grab that. Calibrate the distortion, okay. Uh, nothing interested in here? No? Okay. Hi. What happened? Are you alright? Yeah, it worked. So, the lower setting causes the distortions to manifest, and the higher causes you to shift. That seems promising. Keep it on the lower setting until you want to shift and you should be able to avoid any more accidents. I'd give you my control unit, but it looks like you already have one from the other universe. Love to take a look at that when this is all over. All right, time to shut this down. Right. If you can get down to the research level, you need to make your way to the high energy research lab. Disengage the power interlocks, then pull the emergency shutdown to stop the probe. That should finally put an end to all this. Oh, and before you go, the director wanted to speak with you. Try not to get lost in the hallway again. Yeah, not like I had any control over it. Not like I do now. I see a data slate. Ah, it's another bloody... read this. Oh, 
Well, that's interesting. Right, let us go ahead and speak to the director. Speak. Well then, all set? If you need supplies, I've asked Dr. Barakova to take care of you. It's the least I can do after everything we've put you through. Before you go, there is one other thing we should discuss. If this experiment is the cause of your shifting, when you shut it down, the shifting will stop. What happens then? To you and to us. Uh, I don't know, you tell me. Nishina is a closed system. Two potential states held in tension. When you shut down the experiment, that tension will resolve. You are the outside observer in the system. Whichever reality you are in, at that moment, is what will become real. For you and your universe, at least. The question is, which will you choose? Uh, I don't know. Hmm. If this were a choice between my life and Raphael's, I would ask you to save him. But as the director of the station, I am responsible for the lives of my staff. Thirty people. People with families, careers, futures ahead of them. In this universe, you don't have to decide now. But when the time comes, please, keep them in mind. Now, it's time you are going. With the network offline, we can't shut down the security system on the research level, so you can expect some resistance. Be careful. Ethan, unlock the elevator lobby, please. Ma'am, research level is still locked down. I'm aware of that. I... All right. Done. Good luck, dear. It's been a fascinating day. Uh, I'm sure it has. But yeah, obviously she just told us about the two options that we have to either save this universe or save the universe that Raphael is in. There is, I do not want to do that. There is a hidden option to save both. And I will be attempting to do both. Like I said, I have never tried it. I have no idea what I'm looking for. Tatiana Barakova, I can spare a yeah, few yeah, minutes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Beyond I, that, I, yeah. I, all right, all right. You just um, hang on. Come in. I. I think you should see this. My journal. Have you been in my quarters? Who do you think you are? The director may have given you run of this station, but I. Wait. Wait. What is this? This entry. It's mine, but. I didn't write this. I've never had this conversation. Marks. God. Uh, now you believe me? Yes. Yes, I do. I can spare a few more supplies. And I'll give you a break on anything else you need. Uh, nah. Anyway, as I was about to say, um, the... Take what of that. Saving of both universes. Uh, I haven't done before, so I don't know what I'm looking for. But I know it's something to do with Raphael's body, wherever his body is. I'm guessing it's going to be in the lower level somewhere. So, we've got all the uh, supplies and everything. We need to go yes, to... What? This way. Yeah, down to the elevator. So let's get this done, shall we? Right. Um Yeah, get to the lab. Guessing that cave in happened, that is that's the way out that. I'm going through the entire facility, so. Right, that's near. Let's go ahead. Activate the security that. Security lockdown is active. Emergency override controls are available on designated security terminals. Yeah, which is what we are going to get to. Yeah, if I remember rightly, 
There is no door on the yeah. Oh the robots are out. Take that, take that, take that. Take that. Alright, get inside there is a distortion there and a distortion there. Take the key. Take it there's gonna be a distortion somewhere for these doors. You Yeah. Uh advanced rando. Why not? Anything? Wow, really? Modified mag shear. That is. Oh, right, yeah, I know what that is. I'll take it anyway. It's worth some money. Yeah, take all of that. Stuff that I don't need. I was hoping to find a book or something. I'm not even gonna bother with the chest. I can't be asked to unlock anything. This bloody episode's gonna be a long one as it is. Right. A microscope new. Alright. Bit of that. But they drop ammo. Right, uh, that, what we've got, refined Orion. Nah. History of pirates, nope. Did you pick credits and a safe? Don't even bother with the safe, but take the credits. Right, computer. Security system. Uh, override lockdown. Sorry, robot alarm. Nah. Right, we are right. We're here. Sweet. A security lockdown is active. Emergency override controls are available on designated security terminals. Is it now? Um. Does that one open the door? That just... Oh, okay. Which side do I need to be? On this side or the other side? Uh, it made no difference. And we are... Ah, we're in this room. Wait, we're in this room already? Okay then. Catastrophic damage. Damage. Yep. All systems. I am unable. If you're wondering how I'm yeah, able to get this pinpoint accuracy on the small targets from a distance. I have put slugs in this thing, so... Slugs, with a shotgun, turns it into a bloody sniper. It's mental, I love it. Alright, uh, round eight is just nothing but pods for that. Take out the cameras. 
Alright, we need to get into here. Obviously, we can just pick the lock if we really want to, but that's no fun. Come on. Alright, I need to get over to here, so activate the distortion. And we've got a load of creatures to deal with. Um, you know what? Give me Ember. Yeah, this thing is working brilliantly against these creatures. And we got loads of ammo for it. Nice. Right. Take all of that. Take the med pack. Take the key card. Take all of that. I am cramping again because for some strange reason I get poisoned a lot. Great. Got a body chewing out. And what have we got up here? Ah! Take all of that. Right, let's go and switch universes. Oh, what have we got? Another, another advanced coach, but it's worth seven grand, so I'll take it. Uh -huh. Oh, look! Everything is here again. Uh, robotics lab computer, robotics lab computer. Nah, no, that's not. Because if I do that, then I can just shut down all the robots. Yeah, I need to get through there. Activate you, just so I can slip through the door. And then, where was the. There it is. There is a way in. Oh, right, yeah, 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 I remember now. The reason why we got the key. Into this one, and then into here, there it is. Tweet you. Security lockdown. Override. Thank you. Alright, that should now open up those doors. Yeah, 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 go away. Right. Right, yeah. Got to go back through. Lovely. Now ah, we can go over to here. Yeah. Um, 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 you. Yeah. Uh, pop one of them, give me a heart. You can go away. Uh, what? I just reloaded this bloody thing. I think it's about time I kind of bit the bullet and got rid of this bloody shotgun. Because, yeah, I love the explosive prop that happens because it did just help there, but 
it could be it could uh, do with a bit of extra damage. So let us activate this one and override block down. That opens that door. That opens. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, seeing coffee just reminded me. I need more coffee. So. Let's just get on with where we need to get to. Through here. Yeah. And check what we got. What do we have? A refined tombstone. A refined. No, I'm I'm getting advanced shit spawning now. Why the hell do I want a ref refined? Uh yeah, I won't even bother that, right. Activate that distortion. I got stuck in this little bit for a, a good ten minutes before. I had no idea where the hell I was going to be going. And I'm poisoned again. Uh, I gotta love it. Give me Umber. Come on. With every single bloody creature that pops up. for this. Yeah, it changes. And we advanced solstice, which is pretty much what we're using as a solstice. Um, wow, it is dark as hell in there, isn't it? Yeah, we have to be getting that way, but you know, there's no point having a bloody distortion down there. Obviously we need to go up there. Ah, why the... I was on this and it just decided to push me off. Thanks. Right, now we can activate this distortion. And we is inside, yay. Right, uh... Have a look around. Still haven't found um, Raphael yet. Uh, I wonder where he could. Ah, I bet he's gonna be in the room with the bloody uh, particle beam thing. Right at the end. Is that the ammo? No! Ah, uh, shotgun. Come on. Catastrophic damage. Hey, it's more than catastrophic damage, you're. Yeah. There's the turret. There it is. Thank you. Right, I know we've got to be in there for something. What is this terminal? That is... Yeah. No longer of use to me. Anything in these. Some credits. Might as well take the credits. Uh... Oh look, finally, a helmet that's actually better than what I'm using. Alright, nothing of use in here? Nope, nothing of use in here. Right. Thank you. Just so I can... Wait, what? Ah, right. Yeah, 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 yeah. this way. Uh, and back. Uh, 
Damn, bloody traps, what the hell? Well, only good thing that bitch was for is XP, but... Anything good? Got it, might as well. Don't need any of the resources. And we are... Yeah, we're getting it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Throw the bloody grenade. And I level up. Beautiful. Take all of that. Alright. Controls are available on designated security terminals. Really? I, I had no idea, love. Do I still have coffee? I have no coffee. I have no coffee. I've been recording for an hour, Jesus Christ. Uh no. Are you not gonna activate? You will if that thing catches me. Ah, I knew it. Yeah, this solstice is really slow firing. I can see why you have an option to make this bloody thing fully automatic now. I was a bit of a tanky turret. No, oh, nothing down there. Okay. Ah, right, wait, wait on. I I, I got confused as hell then. Alright, back to make you. Right, that's all blocked off. We can't go that way. Oh, nothing there. Right, access you. Right. Um. Nothing of interest to be picked up in here. No, there is not. No. Ah! I think that's the room I need to get to. Um. Yeah, let's deal with all the, all the enemies. I love how these things throw a rock at you and it poisons you. It just, that makes no sense. Or are they spitting at you? They have those like rocks, it doesn't look like they're powerful, for fuck's sake. You can die. 
Right, I am not activating any of these buttons because I need to go up to this room here. Kill everything before they kill me. Right. Uh, what have we got? Oh, the shit bar looks like right. I'll take that. Nothing is used there. Ah, no! Go away. Uh, yeah, control room. Yeah, the way to save everyone. I know it's something to do with this room. Map controls, initialization. Complete. Are you using. Uh, yeah, let's not mess with that yet. Oh, hi. Can you not get in? Well, clearly I'm missing something, so let us get back through. Right, All of that. Let's take the bloody battle stem. Do I have a battle stem? No, that's a recon stem. Why have I still got recon stims on me? Ah! how much ammo I have for this thing, bloody hell. System failure. Uh. Come on! Ow, ow. Oh, wait. Okay. Oh, shit. Right, where is the... Where is Matey's body? Ow. Ah, there he is. Right, probe calibration protocol. Right. Right, probe calibration protocol. Right. Ensure all power interlocks are engaged. On the lab control computer, initiate the gaussing. Toggle the indicated power interlocks off and back on the to gauss. Verify that all power interlocks have been successfully gauss. Oh wow, um That's gonna be annoying going back and forth. Jesus Christ. Well, <laughs> let's attempt it, shall we? So, obviously you need to get into the control room. There uh, is the... there. Uh, up here... Do I have to do them in... Calibration test. <laughs> right.
Um. This is gonna be interesting. I don't know which bloody universe I need to be in to do this. Alright. Let's attempt it in this universe, shall we? Right, I am fucking thing. Right. Up control terminal. Right. Uh degelsing. Initiate degelsing. Follow Power interlocks require degaussing one, five, six, and seven. Okay. One, five, six, and seven. Do that. Alright. S7. Let's actually do them in order, shall we? Six. Two. Right. Off. And then on. One. Five. Six. Seven. Yeah. Ah. Um, no, I didn't mean to switch universes. You four, five, and six. Yeah, I think I think you do have to do this for both universes, so it's gonna be a bit longer. Alright, are you four? You are four. Four three. Six. Oh, this one's still alive, okay. Right. Do I activate it again, I think? Right, complete. Beautiful. Right. Frequency calibration. Uh, for initiating frequency calibration, calibration, ensure that all power interlocks have been engaged and decaused. Yep. Lovely. Uh, shh. Yeah. Um. We haven't found anything that tells us that, have we? Hang on, what about the calibration test? Uh, so when I test me, it's intake, you can see a 35, but I can't find an output. I've left the slate with the calibration protocol in the control room, but you probably have to experiment with it. Right, so he has left There is a slate here? Wait, is it in the other universe? Wait, that's pissing me off getting trapped in that. Yeah, there we go. 
That's the exact same bloody one, what the hell? Uh, I don't want to have to look this up. Ah. I cheated. I had a quick look at the, uh... What I needed to do. So, for the overrun, if we need to go... Horsey. Nope, sorry. 24. But... Uh, the overrun, which is this universe. Let's go 24. You switch universes. <laughs> Big girls in. Yep, you're done. Frequency calibration. Initiate frequency calibration. And this one is. Uh, 40. Beautiful. Alright, activate primary calibration. Graphic analysis. Inactive. Magnetic analysis. Inactive. Uh, initialization. Complete. Wait, what? Oh, right, it's actually giving me a bloody thing to do. Yeah, because that wasn't weird. What the hell am I looking at? Oh, hello. What does this even mean? Director, he's coming around. Did I do it? I did it! Yay! Careful, dear. Slowly. How are you feeling? Ah. Uh, um. I don't, I, I don't know. I did it. I finished the experiment. So you did? When the lockdown ended, we found you both out cold on the floor of the lab. And then we found our Raphael. I still can't believe it. To me, you've all been dead for months. And then, to see this, it's a lot. It's really a lot. Well, everything worked out, didn't it? So. In the end, I suppose it did. We're never going to be able to publish this. You're free to go. And to take the artifact. I think it is abundantly clear how little we still understand about it. For saving Raphael and our research facilities, I'd like to offer you compensation to the full extent of my authority. And as for me... Nice. I've decided to take a leave of absence. After everything that's happened here, I... need some time to think this over. But... You ever need an engineer? Just say the word. I owe you everything. Thank you. This has been a truly remarkable experience. Beautiful. Can I get out of this? Um Don't you Come on, thank you. Jesus Christ. Right, what is your The doctor wants to keep me a little longer, but I'll be on the next supply ship out of the okay. next time you're in New Atlantis. Look me up at the viewport. If you ever need an engineer or just want to talk, I'll be there. I I, I just wanted to. I only wanted to know what your um skills were. But yeah, that is entangled. We managed to save both universes by cheating a little bit because I needed to look up the um 
frequencies but apart from that i managed to do everything sweet uh but yeah now we have got revelation which is going to masada and that is the final mission of the story that will be done in the next episode but for the moment what did we get given obviously we've got that uh beast on earth all right compare it automatic Right, that's the reason why I'm using the Xeno, because of the 75% uh, chance to reduce damage by 50%. And that one's just a combustion. It's got the exact same stats, except for, obviously, Incendiary. As for the helmet, the helmet is... In a way... So, wait, what? The hell did I get that? And it's a bloody superior one as well, that's... That's tier 5 shit, that. But yeah, anyway, that is Entangled over and done with, and how to uh, save both universes. I love to say, obviously, that this is how you do it. I had to look up, just Whoa. like I said, for one little thing. But still, that's how it was all done. And like I said, I have never done it. I didn't even know what the rewards were for doing it. So... That was a fun little one to do, and it is now night time. So, obviously, next episode, we will be doing the mission Revelation, which, like I said, is the final mission in the story. And I will uh, be showing, obviously, the end of the game. And I will let you know right now before we get to it. There is a very specific point that you get to. I will be making a hard save right there. Just so I can show you all the ending of the game. Because I don't particularly want to be going off starting New Game Plus just yet. When there's still a fair amount of stuff to be doing. Side quests and exploration and mainly getting all the powers. But... The aim of the series really was to show obviously all the story missions and every faction mission which we've completed all four factions which was Ryujin, Free Star, Collective, uh, UC Vanguard and the Sys Dev and uh, Crimson Fleet. If I do end up running through it again I will show the Crimson Fleet side of things. It's not it, The only thing that changes is the final fight and you know the future of what happens between either Sistef or uh, Crimson Fleet but anyway people I'm going to leave it there for today this will be the only one for today I have a hour and a half recording to cut down so that's going to be fun um, so yeah as always people thank you for joining me I hope you enjoy the rest of the day rest of your evening wherever you are in the world and I shall catch you in the next one. Bye-bye.